Ever wondered why airplanes stay afloat in the sky? Welcome to a fascinating journey where we unravel the mystery that keeps these massive machines in the air. It's not just magic, it's science. And the key to this enigma is Bernoulli's principle. This principle named after its discoverer is a fundamental concept that explains how fluids behave. It's the reason why airplanes fly, why curveballs curve, and even why your shower curtain clings to you. It's a principle that's so ingrained in our daily lives, we often overlook it. From the whistling of the wind to the rush of a river, the unseen hands of Bernoulli's principle are at work. It's a principle that has shaped our understanding of the natural world and has led to countless inventions. A Swiss mathematician named Daniel Bernoulli discovered this principle. Now let's dive into the history. The Bernoulli family was full of mathematicians, but it was Daniel who changed the game. Born in the 18th century in Switzerland, Daniel Bernoulli was a man of many talents. He was a medic, a mathematician, and a physicist. But it was his fascination with the flow of fluids that led him to his most famous work. In the year 1738, Daniel published Hydrodynamica, a book that revolutionized our understanding of fluid dynamics. It was here that Bernoulli's principle was first introduced. This principle demonstrated how changes in a fluid speed can affect its pressure. It was a radical idea, a concept that at first glance seemed counterintuitive. Yet, as Daniel Bernoulli delved deeper into the complexities of fluid motion, he found that his principle held true. His work was rigorous, methodical, and above all driven by a profound curiosity about the natural world. Bernoulli's principle was born out of curiosity and a deep understanding of mathematics. So what makes Bernoulli's principle so special? It's all in the equation. Bernoulli's equation, in its simplest form, states that the sum of the pressure energy, kinetic energy, and potential energy per unit volume in a fluid remains constant. This might sound a bit complicated, but let's break it down. Imagine a river flowing swiftly in the mountains, gradually descending onto a plain. Now, where the river is steep, the water flows faster, doesn't it? That's because it has a lot of potential energy due to its height, which gets converted into kinetic energy or the energy of motion. On the other hand, when the river reaches the plains, it slows down. It's not because the water is lazy, but because the potential energy is lower. The water is closer to the ground, so it doesn't have as much height to convert into speed. Now let's talk about pressure. When the water is flowing fast in the mountains, the pressure it exerts on its surroundings is actually less. It's like when you're running a race, you're so focused on moving forward, you don't have time to push sideways. But when the water slows down on the plains, it has more time to exert pressure on its surroundings. This is Bernoulli's principle in a nutshell. It's a beautiful demonstration of energy conservation. The total energy, a sum of potential energy, kinetic energy, and pressure energy, remains constant. The principle is encapsulated in Bernoulli's equation. It's a mathematical representation of this energy conservation relating pressure, velocity, and height at two points in a fluid. But what's truly remarkable about this equation is its universal application. From explaining why airplanes can fly to predicting weather patterns to designing efficient fuel systems, Bernoulli's equation is everywhere. And that's the magic of Bernoulli's equation. It's not just a bunch of numbers and symbols, but a powerful tool that helps us understand and navigate the world around us. The beauty of Bernoulli's equation lies in its simplicity and universal application. Bernoulli's principle is not just a theory, it's all around us. This principle of fluid dynamics is a cornerstone in various fields, breathing life into many of the things we take for granted. One of the most prominent examples of Bernoulli's principle in action is aviation. Have you ever wondered what keeps a massive airplane afloat in the sky? It's Bernoulli's principle. The design of an airplane wing, or airfoil, is such that the air moves faster over the top of the wing and slower underneath. According to Bernoulli, the pressure is lower where the speed is higher. This difference in pressure creates lift, allowing the plane to rise into the air. But Bernoulli's principle doesn't stop at the runway. It extends its reach into our daily weather forecasts. Meteorologists use this principle to predict wind speed. They measure the pressure difference between two points, and with the help of Bernoulli's equation, they can estimate the wind speed 
This helps in forecasting weather conditions, which is crucial for planning various activities from agriculture to space launches. And there's more, the medical field too has been revolutionized by Bernoulli's principle. Ever heard of a Venturi meter? It's a device used to measure the flow rate of fluids. This device, based on Bernoulli's principle, is used in various medical applications. For instance, it's used in ventilators to regulate airflow to patients. And what about the atomizers used to spray perfumes or medicines? You guessed it, Bernoulli's principle again. The principle allows the liquid to be drawn up and atomized into a fine spray, making it easier for us to apply perfumes or for patients to inhale medications. So, as you can see, Bernoulli's principle is not just a formula scribbled on a chalkboard. It's an invisible force that shapes our world. It's in the flight that takes us to our loved ones, in the weather forecasts that guide our plans, and in the medical devices that keep us healthy. Bernoulli's principle has been instrumental in many inventions that make our lives easier. Bernoulli's principle, a simple equation with profound implications. We've journeyed through the annals of history, tracing the legacy of the Bernoulli family, particularly Daniel Bernoulli, the brilliant mind behind the principle that carries his name. We've deciphered the magic equation, a testament to the power of fluid dynamics, and explored its role in numerous applications from flight to fuel systems. In essence, Bernoulli's principle illustrates how an increase in fluid speed results in a decrease in pressure a concept that's reshaped our understanding of the world around us. The Bernoulli family's contributions to mathematics and physics are truly remarkable, with their work continuing to inspire countless inventions and innovations. Now here's a challenge for you. Can you think of another everyday application of Bernoulli's principle? Comment your answer below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Until next time, keep learning, keep 